Karen Pastenia is the founder and editor in chief of Tennis Panorama, and she is at Flushing Meadows tonight joining us live. Uh, Karen, thank you so much. Describe the mood for us right now when Serena took the court tonight and as she continues to play. It was very electric. Uh, it, it was a combination of electricity and fun and also in a way sadness for some of her biggest fans because it could be her last match um if she loses right now she's looking good at six three to all but you know it's a, a it's going to be it's exciting the cheers that she's getting are just crazy rocking the stadium it's it's just electric it's so fun to watch i was a little nervous i caught the part of the first game and we had a couple of double faults and i thought uh oh the nerves are really getting to her but it sounds like she's working it out why is this such a pivotal moment for for tennis for serena as a player as a champion well she's the greatest women's player with 23 major titles and it's sad to see the end of an era um people don't want to let her go but she's 40 she has a life ahead of her probably wants to have another kid she's involved in so many ventures and charities there's more to her than tennis we have and, seen we've seen so many other athletes karen say goodbye only to return get pulled back by their sport and their love for what they were doing uh, for her it's tennis do you think that'll happen with serena I don't think so. I, she's got plans, and I don't think playing tennis again is one of them. She's got, a, she's got, like I said, businesses and other things to do with this life. As a competitor, as a champion, what is her greatest strength? I think she has brought power and fitness. People have tried to uh, emul you know, uh, mark, um, imitate her power and it's become a more powerful game because of her and her sister, really. So people, so, so, so many people have admired her and have tried to copy her. And so there's a generation of women's players who admire her and try to do what she does. Well, let's say she wins tonight and she is on her way to doing that right now, Karen. Um, how will she have to play? What type of tennis will she have to bring to the court for this U.S. Open to win in a, in a really talented field? Well, her next task, should she win tonight, is not an easy one. She'll be playing, she would be playing the second seed, in that contabate. And that would not be an easy task for her. So she's going to have to really have her A game and move well, serve well, to have a chance in that next round if she gets there. Mm. And she's also going to be partnering with her sister for the doubles match uh, coming up later this week. What are their chances as, as a team? It's so fun to watch them on the court. Oh, excellent. When they play, they win. Um, the 14 majors, three Olympic gold medals as doubles partners. Uh, you can't count them out. I feel sorry for their opponents because they, they're not seated. They're not seated. They haven't played doubles for a while, so they won't have a seating. And uh, whoever they play, they won't be happy. Uh, well, thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.